Good afternoon, everyone. Um, well, as you can see, my presentation today is about the question of how to protect the outdoors through fundamental rights and copyright in, uh, from a Latin American scenario. This answers, try to answer a problem based on this question. Is the author important for society? And the idea of this question regards the problem of the interaction between copyright and human rights. Normally, copyright and human rights has been um, analyzed in, as a separate path in which copyright is against human rights in terms of uh, freedom of expression, uh, access to information, and so on. But if we consider the role of the author in copyright, and if we consider that the Article 15 of the ICSRCR um, protects the author in their moral and um, economic rights, uh, or material rights, as it, it says, the question should be now, are authors part of this same problem here? in copyright and here in the protection of cultural, social, economic rights. Um, we can show that there is two approaches. Basically, the positive uh, approach that says that it's possible, but based on uh, how the law of each country uh, protect the author. Or the proposal by Jen that uh, a natural approach, natural rights approach to copyright will be helpful to understand the connection between human rights and copyright. Finally, the general comment 17 from 2005 says, beware, because when the human right protection talks about authors, it's about the persons, about human beings, and not corporations. So the framework would be, OK, there is a constant, historical constant in copyright, in the history of copyright, which is the author. And we used to say that I, there are different approaches, one less authorial, the other more authorial, draw the author, copyright. But we will say, OK, if we are analyze this from a comparative perspective in the protection of authors, what will we find? So the outline for this presentation is talking about some common elements in the copyright theories, considering the author as a natural right, uh, identifying some principles for copyright, uh, identifying how natural rights helps in the connection between human rights and copyright, yeah, and then analyzing how protecting authors could be considered as a fundamental um, issue in the legal systems. Then I will show some partial uh, conclusions that I raised now and for the research that I hope I will develop. So first of all, there is some common elements that I can find in copyright theories. Which are those elements? First, that there is an interest in access and participation in cultural life for copyright or for human rights. That both deal, deals with the absolutist dilemma. Is that absolutely property copyright or not? Should be or not? Should be a reward or a property? It has an effect. It affects uh, freedom of expression. It protects freedom of expression. It affects the free market of knowledge. It is copyright efficient or effective for the protection of authors and the access to the free market of knowledge. It protects the existence of a raw material available to create more works. Is the question of the author a something preeminent in copyright and both in human rights? It's the same question. Is the author important for society? What happens with the moral rights? Are moral rights a common ground for 
the protection of in copyright and in auto rights. And finally, a more legal question, is a good or is a right copyright? Is, is, is property was simply a right? Okay, from those, sorry, from those um, common elements, I want to highlight some principles. First, the principle of labor and reward. If you work, if you do something, if you create something, you will have a reward. And you do something because you create that using your freedom of expression. And you use that freedom of expression and participate with your freedom in the market of knowledge, exercising some kind of power. That will be recognized by copyright as a property. And that will give you the choice to decide to participate and to promote your knowledge for society. And who is that person? Who is that person who can create? So through these principles, we will say we have some rights that we can identify in general. A right for access to and participation in the cultural decisions the protection of the author as something important for society, and also the promotion of creativity through some rewards and some uh, property. Okay, let's move on. From there, it's important to understand that copyright can be considered fundamental for the cultural construction of consensus and the communi communicative interaction towards the equal equals access and participation in society. We should go beyond the mere functionalism of copyright and consider it that copyright has a place in the communicative structure of society and is more than economic, is, is more important than a mere economic development problem. It also underlines the in interaction between persons. It's how we manage intersubjectivity. And that also is connected with human rights rationalis. So the study that I realized is comparing some different countries in the statutes, the case law, and their constitutions. So we can check some principles regarding how the author is considered in these different legislations. How I did it using the six principles for authorship that James Gins Jane Ginsburg wrote in 2003. These principles, mind over muscle, is meaning that the more important thing for authorship is putting your mind. Mind over machine is not important, the machine is what is behind the machine. Uh, originality equals authorship. Only original things can be created by authors. Not to create it, but some sweat is required to create something. And the principle of intent, if you want to create, you need to have the intention to create something. And also, the principle of money tax. In some, time, in some cases, it has been accepted that authorship can be, cons can be conferred to corporations, but this is only important in the extent that these corporations are the only ones who can put in society some particular works. So in this analysis, what I have been able to show is that the originality threshold is a fundamental protection for the system, and the protection of author's autonomy is also completely important towards the protection of his community communicative power. So, in this, sorry, in this um, analysis, what I try to show is that there is a fundamental interest in protecting authors, and this is a matter of balance between his, the, the author's dignity and his autonomy. This interest is balanced, or should be balanced, with the interest of the other right holders. And that is only possible with some elements that the legislation compared show. Restriction in contracts. 
limitations in the amount of property that can be transferred to the right holders. The protection of uh, the horizontal effect between the interest of the author and the interest between, uh, of the right holders. The possibility to make um, part of the market the work and also achieve the communicative purpose of copyright. I mean, copyright doesn't matter if it's not to communicate something. Okay. So, the basic conclusions for this is that there is a constitutional protection for authors' interest, that there are legal mechanisms protecting authors as a weak uh, part in the negotiation of the contractual relationships, that there are active case law um, that recognize the connection between, uh, between authorship and originality, that author's freedom is funda a fundamental element in this protection and for creativity, that there are limitations of autonomy in the contractual relationship, not only protecting authors, but also protecting, in some cases, the marketability of the works. Um, it's also a fundamental protection uh, of author dignity, and that gives us enough space to negotiate and protect and re um, reconsider how authors are positioned on uh, society. Oh, sorry. Finally, there are some elements to analyze further implication in the international framework and the relations with uh, other international agreements. Thank you very much.